Even though most people claim to be dog people, cats are actually much more popular as pets. With there being around 88.3 million pet cats in the United States alone, it is easy to see that they are an integral part of many people's homes. Although cats as a whole are incredibly popular, only being beaten as the number one pet by freshwater fish, certain breeds are more popular than others. Breed personality and appearance are two factors that make certain cat breeds more popular than others. Domestic Shorthair Cats Even though domestic shorthairs are not an official breed, they are still the most popular type of cat today. Domestic shorthairs, which are completely different from American shorthairs, are the cat versions of mutts. Their origins are mixed and unknown, which is why they aren't an official breed. Experts believe that the domestic shorthair became domesticated around 2000 BC in Egypt. Since then, the domestic shorthair has traveled the entire globe. Today, they are great pets, but they are also known for having avid hunting skills. As mutts, domestic shorthairs come in many shapes and sizes. Most commonly, they are medium-sized with short and soft coats. They can come in just about any color too. American Shorthair Cats Distinct from the domestic shorthair is the American Shorthair. This breed is incredibly sweet and cuddly, but it is also known to be hardy, alert, and muscular. Something people love about this breed is that they tend to be sociable and kind to humans while still being independent. Because the American Shorthair was bred for working purposes, these cats are very muscular and athletic. They love to chase mice and other small animals, like birds. If you get an American Shorthair, it's a great idea to invest in an interactive toy to keep them entertained. As their name suggests, American Shorthairs come with a shorter length coat, but their coloration range is much more limited than the domestic Shorthair. British Shorthair Cat One incredibly old breed is the British Shorthair, and it is just as popular today as it was centuries ago. Many people believe that the British shorthair was brought to England by the Romans around the time of the first century. At this point, the cat likely existed and was bred with native breeds of England. After that, the British shorthair was bred with Persians, creating the cat we know and love today. British shorthairs are one of the most popular breeds, likely because they are one of the most popular cats to be featured on television, in movies, and in books. Different forms of entertainment, ranging from Stephen King's Pet Cemetery to the Cheshire Cat and Alice in Wonderland, Showcase British Short Hairs Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. Domestic Long Hair Cat Domestic long hairs are comparable to domestic short hairs, except they have long hair, as you probably figured. Just like domestic short hairs, these cats are mutts, meaning they don't have a known ancestry and they aren't purebreds. It is believed that domestic long hairs were bred by people who lived in Russia, Turkey, and Iran. Since then, the breed was likely brought over to the Americas via ships where they were used for controlling the rodent population. Since this breed is not purebred, their long fur can come in just about any color, ranging from white to black to orange. Because of their long hair, they will likely need regular grooming. Maine Coon Cat Maine Coons are easily one of the most noticeable purebred breeds. They have an incredibly heavy coat, which allows them to survive the harsh Maine winters. More so, they have a really large body that makes them larger than the average cat. Despite their large size, Maine Coons are gentle giants. They love to be around their owners and people in general. Something else that's really unique about this breed is that their water-resistant coat means that they love playing in the water. Because Maine Coons were bred in the wild, they have a very distinct and wild-looking coat. The coat is very long, and it tends to have multiple colors of white, brown, gray, and black, allowing them to fit in with the environment. Ragdoll Cats For people wanting the ultimate lap cat, the ragdoll is where it is at. This breed is large and fluffy. Even though they are on the larger side, they get their name from the fact that they are often carried around like ragdolls. Often classified as one of the friendliest breeds, ragdolls love to follow around their human companions. They are even known to greet humans at the door and sleep in bed with them. Ragdolls also make perfect cats for apartments since they aren't the most active breed. It wasn't until the 1960s that ragdolls were specifically bred. Since then, the breed has a darker face and darker points, but the entire body tends to be lighter. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.